Hi, I'm John from WorkshopAddict.com. If you're into wood turning, you may have already heard of the Nova Infinity Quick Change Chuck System. If not, let me tell you, this system dramatically reduces the amount of time it takes to switch from one set of jaws to the next, which is in the end goal what you want to do. You want to spend more time turning rather than stopping to switch out your jaws or switch out your chucks. Uh, whatever it may be. Now the really cool thing about this system that, that I find just really cool is you can either go out and buy the new chuck which will come with everything you need and you're ready to go or you can take your already existing Nova Supernova 2 chucks or your G3 chucks and you can retrofit them so you don't necessarily need to go through the expense of buying a whole brand new chuck. Um, some people like to have multiple chucks but you can go ahead and retrofit your old one. So, if you want to see how to retrofit this chuck, click up here on this video and I will take you through the steps. But this video, we're gonna talk about the actual Nova, Supernova Infinity chuck here and how it works and what the benefits are. What I do is if you buy the new Infinity chuck system, I wanna show you what you're gonna get and how to put it together. It's really simple, uh, basically. In this kit, you are going to have the Supernova 2 chuck all set up, ready to go, along with a uh, Allen wrench that has some push pins on the end of it. And this is something you're going to need. You don't exclusively need this, but this is going to help everything work better. You're also going to have a, a, word, a wood worm screw, and then your jaws, a number three bowl jaws. Um, in here, it's a little difficult to see, but you'll see in the slides here, right behind it is your number. And that's going to correspond with the number on your chuck that is displayed right here. So I'm going to have some close-ups of that. Really all you have to do when you take this out of the box, you need to open the jaws up all the way. Um, when you make jaw changes with this, it helps. It's the easiest way to do it is make sure you have as much room as possible. So open it all the way up. And then find your numbers that match. This is a four. There's four. And honestly, it's this simple. Slide it into place, it locks, it's in. Here's number one. Slide it in, it's locked. Two. Slide it in, locked. Last one, three. You're gonna line it up correctly and it locks into place. They're all in there and they're ready to go. Now the only thing that you don't get with this kit, um, it, it depends on what lathe you have, is your insert. This is what you'll need to make sure it fits onto your lathe correctly. You can look these up on the Nova site and um, if you have any questions they can help you. But get the proper one, screw it into your chuck, then you're going to put in the set screw with the, I can't I believe it's called a grub screw. You put that in there and it locks it into place and you're all set to go. That simple, take it out of the box, put it together and now you're ready to go. Um, I'm going to show you these little um, push pins I was telling you about. This is how you take the jaws off if you want to switch them. On the end of the, the chuck right here you will see um, where you have your numbers, there's a lock position, unlock position, all you have to do is push that in, slide the jaw back out, pops right out. So that's how quickly you can change these jaws. So now you know how to put it together and you know what to expect in the box. Now that we see what comes with this new chuck and how to put it together, the next question should be, um, Jaws, can I use my old ones? How can I make it work with the system? Do I need to buy new ones? The answer to that is you can do it either way. Like I said, this comes with the number three bowl jaws. And if you want, Nova's coming out with a whole line of new jaws uh, this year. And right now, for instance, there's the Infinity Sawtooth jaw that you can buy as a kit. So if you buy the new ones, they already come with what you need to slide it into the chuck. So you can buy different kinds of jaws. Again, they're numbered just like you'd expect. So if you find the number two on there, find it on the chuck, 
take your roll off, take your number three bulge off and put the sawtooth on on. Slides right in. Snaps right into place and you're ready to go. Switch them all out, you're all set. Now, if you have old existing jaws with your system and you want to stay with them, you can go that route too. All you need to do is, for instance, I have some cold jaws here. Um, when you attach them to your old Supernova or G3 chuck, there is some Allen screws that you, you'll, I'm sure you're aware of this, that you need a number four Allen wrench or a number four metric, four millimeter Allen wrench to put them on and off the old chuck system. You would have to remove the Allen screws there, put the new one on. Or you can go out and buy a retrofit kit and there is these little slides that you will need. Take those, basically put them on the back side, use your Allen screws, put them on the jaw, each one of the jaws, and it will be permanently affixed to this old jaw. And once they're there, you can actually just take them straight from there and lock them into place. So you can actually take all of your old jaws that you have from Nova and switch them over so they work on your new system. That's the great part about this is whether you have an old chuck or you buy the new chuck, you have the jaws you can continue to use with both chucks if you go ahead and buy the retrofit kit or you can buy all brand new jaws. And I said, as I'm saying, in 2015, they're gonna be coming out with quite a few of their jaws set up for the system. I just wanted to show you quickly how this infinity chuck system will speed up your time. Typically when I would do a bottle stopper, I'd set it into the, the lathe, drill out the hole for the mandrel, then I'd have to pull off, you know, take the chuck off, pull off the jaws, so then I can put the mandrel back on it. So we're gonna do this real quickly without having to remove the chuck with the new infinity system. As you can see, I never had to take off the chuck. I have the mandrel mounted in the chuck already. I took the old jaws off, and this took me virtually no time at all. This was one of the hang-ups if I wanted to come into the basement and get a project done real quick. Um, coming home from work, I have limited time. And, you know, it's not a big deal, but this does make the whole process a lot more enjoyable. So, if you're into turning, and you want to spend less time changing out jaws, check it out. Matter if you are purchasing a brand new Nova Infinity quick change chuck system or you're retrofitting your Supernova 2s or G3 chucks, either way you're going to be spending less time changing out the jaws and more time turning at your machine. And really in the end that's what it's all about. So hopefully this has been of some help and until next time I'm John from workshopaddict.com. Talk to you later.